Yo, what's good everybody? It's your man Jenks back up in here. About to do another um another um oh air fryer. Something, something. This is actually a request. You know what I'm saying? Cause I haven't done I might ask if you could do fish in the air fryer and yeah, that's one of the many things you can do. Fish, chicken, steak, you know, a bunch of other things. I just found out you could do baked mac and cheese in there too. Well, I gotta try that in the upcoming video. But anyway, I'm gonna run through this real quick because this is one this is gonna be one of the lunchtime cooking videos. But I'm on my lunch break right now. But fish in the air fryer don't really take too long to cook, so let me just run it through with run it through with y'all real quick. I got three pieces of cod fillets right here. The only thing I'm gonna do with it, I just washed them off or whatever. They're still kind of wet because I'm not gonna use an egg batter for this. Um, on the fish itself, I'm just gonna put salt and pepper. Damn, why are you even putting no olive oil on? I don't like that. It's gonna get sprayed when it goes into the pan, so I don't really need olive oil for this right now. These blinders, man. I feel like you're breaking your wrist off. Alright. This salt, I hate iodized salt. But my um my sea salt grinder is gone. And um my other grinder is gone just realized. So I don't really have time to run to the store. I'm just gonna take a little bit. And just sprinkle it on. Yeah, keep it simple. Sprinkle it on, alright? To that and go. Now I'm gonna put the other stuff right here is really good. You know what I'm saying? For the, so I take what I got left over. I did some chicken the other day, which is up on my channel if you want to see that one. Uh, put this in the bag. Okay, I got a little pan, roller spray. I mean, olive oil spray. You know, I only use either vegetable oil, canola oil, or olive oil. So, I'm going to run with this right now. Go in there, take the pieces. We're going to put them into a bag. And just shake the bag up, keep it old school. That's the way you seen your mamas do it. Uh, well, they have brown paper bags. I got a Wegmans bag. So, Take off all the excess. Put that back on. Take that off. This it. Place it. Now you want this to sit for about, I'm gonna let it sit for like five minutes or so. You know, I'm gonna come back, let this just like stick, stick to it. Come back, we're gonna put it in the air fryer. We're gonna cook it for about 10 minutes. I'm gonna check it. If it needs it, I'm gonna do it for a little more, maybe five more minutes at 400 degrees. I'm gonna show y'all what y'all been doing with this air fryer thing, man. The bomb, B. All right, people. Five minutes has passed. I preheated the um, air fryer for about five minutes at 400 degrees. And now, I'm gonna spray, well, I'm gonna spray the pan first. So let's get into the air fryer. Okay, this is the Chef Man 3.5, I think. That's the size of the um, basket. As like y'all can see, I use this a lot because the name is damn near wore off. So. We're gonna spray the pan. Place these in here. Just like you would if you was frying in a pan, you don't want to overcrowd it because the airflow has to flow evenly. But this is only three pieces, so I should be straight. Spray the fish. It looks like a lot, but this isn't even that amount of spray doesn't even like add up to the amount you put in the pan. So, right, this should be done. I'm gonna turn it off here. Take a look. Oh yeah. Talking about right there. This is about maybe uh, a little over 20 minutes. 
you know so about the first 10 minutes which y'all didn't see that but i have flipped them and then for the last 10 minutes um you know clipped it on the other side you know so, you got to take this out go here with this huge ass salad I'm bugging because I'm still working right now too. I'm sitting here making cooking videos. But that's it right there, yo. That's my skill. I'm not sure. Let me give y'all a little, let me give a little taste test first. Let's see how it tastes. Mm. Oh my god. Mm. You know what's really hitting on this? The salt and pepper from the beginning and the flavor from that um from that Kentucky um kernel was really hitting that salt and pepper that's the first thing I taste when I buy into it. Mm. Oh yeah. Well, I'm gonna go back to work. I'm about to eat this and um I'm gonna get a thumbnail. I'm gonna get my thumbnail. You know, I should put some dressing on that look dry. Anyway, yo, that's my spell on oven fried fried fish. You know what I'm saying? And the air fryer. You better get one. Change your life. Make you feel better.